Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys uh, something called importing another session into your actual session. Uh, basically, you use this when, let's say, let's say you got a nice drum line that you like to start all of your sessions off with. Like, you know, you have your nice snare, you have your nice kick, you have all the right instrument. Uh, basically, uh, instruments that you like to start your song with. <clears throat> I'm going to show you guys how to get those audio files into any session that you start. So basically, I'm going to import one of my sessions into a previous session that I'm working on. I'm going to go up to File. I'm going to go down to Import. I'm going to go to Logic Projects. It's gonna All my projects are going to pop up. Let's say I like the kicks in r and I'm going to click it. It's going to open up to the side, and I can individually add uh, files to the session that I'm working on, that I'm currently working on. So let's say I like the Firefly's harp. I click on content. I, 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 I check it. I go down to add, and you'll see it pop up in my session. Where is it? Right here, Firefly's harp. Uh, very easy. Uh, as soon as you understand it, actually. It's very complicated if you don't understand it. But that's basically how you get one audio file out of a whole session. I hope I showed you guys something new. I hope you guys learn it in the future. And uh, thank you guys for watching my video. And please subscribe.